How can we represent this two-dimensional vector? In video one we discuss displacement. It's just a reminder. First walked a distance of four meters, followed by a distance of three meters. We worked out our overall displacement to be given by this vector here. So we needed to know both the horizontal and the vertical parts in order to be able to compute our overall displacement. Here we're going to work backways. We know that the vectors i and j are the unit vectors along these axes, so we can decompose this vector in terms of its horizontal and vertical parts. It's just doing that now. So this is a length of 2, which corresponds here to a length of 2 in the direction of the i vector. And this is a length of 3, which corresponds here to a length of 3 in the direction of the j vector. So the blue vector can be represented by 2i plus 3j. So this vector is the vector beginning at the point 0, 0 and ending at the point 2, 3. So any two-dimensional vector can be represented in terms of the basis unit vectors i and j.